If you're under 13 years old, you must make sure you have your parents or guardians permission to watch this video. The content in this video is family friendly, but data may be collected by YouTube for advertising purposes. I'm taking a bit of a shine to it, to be honest. I didn't kidnap you. What happened, Geraldine? Are you kicking me out? Compensation. I love you and I want you back. Who's this? <laughs> what do you mean, Colin? Colin who? What's going on here? I've worked really hard on this house. Who's paid you? Geraldine. They were my diamonds. <laughs> you can... oh. He said anything and everything within the property to get rid of it. Hey, hang on a minute. Hmm, that, that one looks familiar. Let them be a reminder that you can have any sheep you want on the server, but not that one. My secret plan to get my sheep back is to trick Zloy into basically giving me it back by pretending I'm somebody else. Mr. Onions, the latest member of the truly bedrock realm, and this is my Alan. This is not sheep, this is a cow. We don't have time to do this, we've got to leave, it's season one coming up, we have to just, just, just take these diamonds will you and, uh, and give me my sheep back, but you're going to have to stay in here for now while I get things sorted out. Where's the sheep? Where's my sheep? Geraldine! Where's Geraldine and Colin? Dear Foxy, if you're reading this then I'm already gone. Colin and I have taken the sheep you gave us. What? I didn't give you a sheep? Into the future? I can't tell you when, but I'm sure one day I'll pass something something again. Sheep of dreams? You need to make a choice. Sir Onion, you're not even real. How do you know I am not real? You need to choose the right path. That Excuse one, get me. one free on the rock. Um, uh, uh, have you seen my stickers? Why is Mr. Onion here? It has been a long time since I have seen you. Don't leave me, leave me alone. No, 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 no. Ah! <laughs> oh, no. We need to have a funeral. I think here I was hoping that the amount of your alternative personalities were finally diminishing. Mr. Onion was a great friend who attempted to convince you to remain in your dream world forever. Sadly, he failed. I think I can use that moon rock to bring Mr. Onion back to life. Oh, that's a little bit weird. Ah! Ah! Alive. Oh my goodness, there is a lot of bad guys over there. Wait, who is this? You better stay out of my way. Oh my goodness. Run away, run away quick. Get out of here if you can. Save yourself. Mr. Onion? Mr. Onion? Listen. Listen, Mr. Onion, I'm here. Oh my goodness. Oh, the Merlin Rock is coming. He's going to kill us. And, uh, uh, hello? Who are Mr. Zloyexpo? Oh, dear. You... He done did it, didn't he? Look. Uh, why, why, why are you here? There is a giant moon rock coming and it is going to kill us and I am hiding in this house. Oh, so you are just really overestimating the blast proof p potential of nether break. Where else can I go? Have you seen the size of it? It is going to kill us all. Yeah, about that. I'm uh, currently taking all my stuff, all my possessions and evacuating into the nether. I advise you do the same. So uh, yeah, follow me. Into the nether, we will be safe in there, yes? Do, do, have you seen Foxy himself? Oh, I'm here. Can you no, I me? cannot find him. He seems to have disappeared. I do not know where he is. Well, that thing is... Okay, I have more villagers to pack up and put into the, the nether hub. But you, just go ahead. I'm pretty sure you have literally zero mortal possessions in this plane of reality. 
What do you mean that figures? When you say he's gone missing, you said that figures. Why does it figure? Because his base and consequently my base is about to get hit by a giant meteor. It figures that he would be either dealing with it or hiding from it. Okay, I understand, right? I will escape. Thank you very much. I will see you later. I hope not. Goodbye, Mr. Expert. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe it. <gasps> Mr. Lizard, you are here. What, what, what are you doing back? What, what where's you, Foxy? I need Foxy. What do you need him for? The, have you seen what's going on out here? Things are getting crazy out here. I need to talk to Foxy because we got some serious problems. We got to get situated. I'm here. Slack, I'm here. Pardon, what did you say? Uh, I didn't say nothing, man. What? What? No, I, I need to find Foxy because there's like meteors coming in. Like I had stuff hit over at my base. This is getting crazy, man. Okay, okay, far enough. Well, uh, I think uh, what happened is, uh, well, I wake up in my grave and there was this dark fox guy going around killing all of these weirdos what? around Foxy's dark, house. Huh? And, what? Uh, da dark fox? Uh, what? Huh? That that's all I know. I have not seen Fox No Tail since I wake up. Maybe he has gone. Maybe he has trotted off along the river down to escape from the mules, if you know what I mean. No, 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 I have no clue what you mean. W where do you think he is? Where can we uh, find him? I did not know. I have not seen him. Maybe he has escaped. Maybe he has gone off to season two already. I don't know. Well, you know, he was trying to get the moon rock from Silent to actually, I think, bring you back. Is he at the graveyard? The moon what? The, uh, it could be, I guess, if he was bringing me back to... Maybe there, something went wrong. Maybe he got Maybe. hurt. <gasps> we should go and find him. Maybe, yes. Yes. To the graveyard. Okay. Which way is the graveyard? Uh, this way. I will follow you, Mr. Lizard. Oh my goodness. So many bad guys. Get all the bad guys.
Come on, Mr. Lizard, quickly. Here, my grave is over in this direction. We can possibly find it. <gasps> Who is that? Geraldine? That's it, Onion. I'm taking over. Geraldine! Geraldine? Hey, wait. How do you know Geraldine? Slack, it's me. I'm inside Mr. Onion. What the? Whatever you get up to in your own time, dude, I, I, I don't want to know about it, man. No, Slack. Something happened when I brought Mr. Onion back to life and I got stuck inside his mind. What? Well, where's your body at then? It's that dark fox dude that's going around killing everyone. That's basically my body without my soul in it. We need to get it back so we can put me back inside my body. Dude, we've got bigger issues right now than your body. Like the giant moon rock. <sighs> You're right, but what are we going to do? The last one blew my base to pieces. I, I don't know, dude. I, I got lots of slime blocks from the slime farm. Maybe we could build a bouncy pad for it to hit and bounce back out. It's a nice idea, but I don't think there's enough slime in the world to stop that thing. Foxy, get out of my head. I have a plan. Excuse me! Excuse me, young lady! Are you Geraldine? Huh? I am Mr. Onion! Huh? I have an idea how you can stop the moon rock from crashing into the house. Huh? You are rich, correct? <laughs> and you can do magic, yes? <laughs> well, this ship has the most lovely, sick, shiny world I have ever seen. Huh? Well, what if it was bigger? Huh? Giant Sheep of Dreams! <laughs> no! Not my Sheep of Dreams! Don't do anything but my Sheep! Shut up, Foxy! It is either your Sheep or your house, and probably everyone else's houses too. Okay, fine. But I'm not happy about it. Goodbye, Sheep of Dreams! Goodbye, Foxy. This was always my destiny. Remember to keep choosing the right path. I will. We better stand back, Mr. Lizard. Come on, quick! Oh, and one more thing. What? Sheep of Dreams, what is it? You can get your body fat back. Fiddlesticks. I think I might let somebody else be cleaning all of this up. My sheep, what was he going to say? Onion, listen, let me take control. No chance. I got my body back. You get your own. What was that? Oh, uh, nothing. <sighs> Good talk, Onion. Good talk. No! Onion, give me the wheel. I'm fixing this now. Now get out, stop! I won't stop till you let me take control again. It's my buddy. Leave me alone. I've got stickers. I'm listening. Sly! Sly! Oh, well, this is nothing. This is never good. Yes, hi. I need your help, buddy. Look, for the future, there is no door. Just walk in, okay? This is a public library. Okay, um, you may be wondering why I look like Mr. Onion. I'm currently in control of his body, and because my body is wandering about on the server killing bad guys, and I would like to get in my body again because Mr. Onion doesn't really want me in his. Okay, lots to process there. Kind of utterly confused. You are in the body of... Mr. Onion, which is basically your body, but in a dumber hat. What? What? Don't you look, look exactly like. the same. What? No. No, 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 not even close. You'd, if you're gonna not be sensible, look, Sloy, I've come to you for help. You didn't help me with the resurrection. Now look what's happened. We, me and Mr. Onion are sharing a body. My body's off doing stuff. And I, actually, we, I just want to go back to normal. Okay, what stuff is your body doing? Uh, kill it. He's going around at the moment, killing bad guys and pretty much anyone that gets in his way. All right, what kind of bad guys we're talking? Um, well, I'm pretty sure from everything I've seen the last few days that they're the people that keep bringing the moon rocks down from the moon, like like the Vokers and people. It's a bit weird. Okay, so you want to stop the only guy who's doing anything about the moon situation? Mm, yes. Yeah, that does sound pretty bad, doesn't it? Yes, it does, actually. Uh, he is doing a pretty good <sighs> okay. job, to be fair. But that's my body! Look, you can't look, just go tell running you off with it. Tell you what, tell, t tell you what. You and Mr. Onion are currently in the same body, right? Yes. How is that any different from how it was before? Uh, well, we were separate for a start. Look, if the guy, okay, the body, the, the other one, 
yeah. comes into play, if we can catch him, if, if we can find him to begin with, if he starts obstructing stuff that we're trying to do, we'll deal with him and somehow squeeze you back in. But for the time being, can you just kind of deal with this stuff? You mean I gotta stay inside Mr. Onion's body? This is exactly how it was before! <laughs> I do not want this horrible fox inside my body. This is my body. I have just got it back. I was dead. I'm alive and I want him out. Well, uh, see? See, he's a nightmare. Yeah, the, you both are. How am I supposed to record videos if I'm stuck inside Mr. Onion? Well, I, I don't know. Maybe you can figure out something. The two of you seem to be friends enough. Uh, fine. Right. Okay, Onion. What's it going to take? What do you mean? I mean, come on, if we're going to do this and we're going to share, I want 50-50 on this body, what's it going to take? Uh, what about some stickers and maybe a stack of diamonds? Uh, some stickers and a... I can do that. I can do a stickers and a stack of diamonds. Okay, then we have a deal. You can have it on Mondays. I will have it the rest of the time. Very good. Thank you, slow. Goodbye. Hey, wait. No. Well, here I am, back in my skin, still inside Mr. Onion's body. We've had a long chat. He's prepared to uh, to let me do my videos as long as I give him plenty of stickers and plenty of diamonds. But to be honest with you, this big ordeal has thrown me so much that I think I just I could do with some space. I could do with some time off. And to be honest with you, I feel like we've pretty much finished everything we need to do around here. So. Yeah, I think, I think I'm just going to end Season 1 there and I'm going to head off to Season 2. And if you don't know how we're going to do that, I have been saying in my live streams and things, we'll just use the teleporter. We'll just use the teleporter so there's no time like the present. We might as well do that now. So yeah, let's get into it. See you later, dogs. I'm sure Big Chicken will be around to look after you all. We've done, like, world tours. We've done recap episode 100s. There really is nothing else left to do around here. We might as well just go. Uh, uh, am you not forgetting something? What do you mean? Uh, my stickers and my 64 diamonds you promised me? Oh, come, Mr. Onion, come on, look, we've got to share this body. Let's not get silly about it. We'll do that when we get to season two. Come on, let's get this teleporter fired up. I've had enough. I need some space. We, me and you need to work this thing out together. Let's do this. I could not agree more. Let's get us set up early on season two and take some time to reflect and figure out how we are going to separate ourselves. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. All right, let's do this then. Let's just randomly throw in a bunch of coordinates. We're going to a whole new world, so I suppose it doesn't really matter what the coordinates are where we get there. And this is the dimensional one. I just think if we spin this round a few times, it's going to take us just completely out of this world and into a new one. I'm pretty sure that's how it'll work anyway. So let's then uh, turn on the Ender Pearl system. Let's turn on the beacon beam. Now, technically, we should have... Uh, the fear the sheep of dreams is in here so technically we should really have someone powering this thing for us but i'm pretty confident we can just walk straight into that beam and have no problems at all so i'll see you later guys you can say bye mr onion goodbye mr onion let's do this bye